So I almost got into some trouble today. And Acura, you're not being accurate, coincidentally. So this client of mine saw an advertisement on an Acura TLX, a 2019 model. And he saw it for $235 a month, obviously not including tax. Um, <laughs> Didn't read the fine print and flipped out when I told him this car is going for about 400 bucks a month. Um, me, obviously, doing what I do best, assumed what the typical customer actually wanted and didn't go by this ad. The ad car that they're using doesn't specify which trim it is except for a stock number. You plug in the stock number and it brings you to this car, which is like straight up a four cylinder front wheel drive Acura TLX, which is not what he was looking for. So my response was this. So send me the actual car that you want. And it turned out to be an all wheel drive V6 instead of a $33,900 car was a $39,195 car, such as the one that I just showed you. Let me tell you a little bit about discounts on Acura. So Acura has about 7%. From MSRP, the sticker price, down to their invoice price. Now, don't take that as me trying to tell you that's all you should get as far as discount. That would be absolutely ridiculous and irresponsible of me to tell you this. So Acura has a bunch of cash that comes from the factory, which makes it a lot easier to lease out this car. Plug in the lease cash into the calculator, which right now is about $34.50. Um, plug in the residual, right now it's at 56%. It's typically about this. Um, Acura doesn't go crazy as far as the money factor. It charges typically whatever the promo rate is for that month, which is 2.9% on the TLX for this month. So it's a double zero one two four money factor. You plug in about a 7% discount. You plug in the rebates. You capitalize all the fees and boom. I'm at 430 a month, precisely what I had given him as a rough estimate this morning. Acura TLXs, since I was just quoting you on the base, it's very easy for them to advertise this car at like 299 because what they like to do is you put down three grand and you put down that three grand on top of the deal that I just doctored up and that already brings you to 330. Take out tax and you're at 299, right? If they want it to be really, really dirty, they switch it from 12,000 miles a year or 10,000 miles a year down to 7,500 and use a cheaper car. If we go apples to apples, a comparable, let's say, A spec would probably be going for about 500 bucks a month, if not a tiny bit more, but they, they're probably advertising for about like 400 a month. So you gotta be careful when you're reading these ads. Definitely check stock numbers at the very bottom. Uh, definitely check to see how much miles per year and how much total cash do it start. When they say 3,000 down, it usually means like 3,000 plus fees. If it's saying zero down, it probably means the fees. So I hope this video helps. If it did help, please give it a nice thumbs up below. If you're seeing this on Facebook, share it maybe, if I'm lucky. And if you're seeing this on Instagram, just double tap the hell out of your screen. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.